it's your girl Lo or Taisha, whichever you want to call me. I'm going to answer to it, okay? And in this video, as you can tell by the title, I'm going to be talking to you guys about why I decided to leave the cosmetic industry. I know a lot of y'all probably looking at my site right now saying, Lo, you still sell cosmetics though. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. I'm shifting. It's all a process. I can't just remove everything, you know, so... I'll get into the rest into the video, but I'm gonna be doing a get ready with me. I'm gonna do my hair because this is just frizz and it's looking crazy. And I'm gonna do my makeup and talk to you guys a little bit about everything y'all need to know pertaining to my business and me moving on. Okay, I am bare faced right now. There's nothing on my face but Carmex. with this makeup video let me tell y'all i said i'm moving out of the cosmetic industry i am not a professional makeup artist i don't do makeup professionally i just do it on me to look good to look cute do what i gotta do to pull through okay so i don't need none of y'all coming for my makeup techniques oh you missing primer oh you missing con not even concealer i might add concealer i might not oh you missing contour oh you missing ah, ah. okay so why i left the cosmetic industry do i have a sharpener why I decided to leave the cosmetic industry. I left because I feel like you should, everybody should try something at least once in their life. And I feel like I was just getting, when I started my business, I started my business two or three years ago. And at that time, it wasn't, it wasn't a trend for people to start their businesses. So I don't want to say I'm an OG because I'm definitely not. But let me just say, I was here before it was a trend to even start your own business. Not a flex, not stunting anything. I'm just, I'm just saying. She's about to do what she's about to do. And she's about to show what the girls should have did. Keep talking, matter of fact, because that's just making her hot. Man, like usual, niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. All right, so yeah, I decided to start my business like two, three years ago, and I was I want to do cosmetics because I knew when I did cosmetics, I'll get more into cosmetics because as I said, I don't really wear makeup like that. You can communicate this product, you can make money off the product. Cause look at Gaga, she's the creative director of Polaroid. I like some of the Gaga songs. What the f does she know about cameras? Gotta go where the money resides, baby. I only started wearing makeup. This is my eyeshadow palette, my very own. You can still buy it from my website, $25. Ciao. This isn't that short. This part isn't that short. This part is still in the bun. This part is out, though. So I don't need y'all saying this is mad uneven. It's, it's... But y'all can still get this on my website. Mm. I knew once I started a cosmetic business that I would be more into makeup and that's really what my goal was to strive more into doing makeup without having to buy all these other products i mean why buy other products when i can make money while wearing makeup using my own brain you know what i'm saying so i was with it this is when i realized i'm gonna be real with y'all this is the first eyeshadow palette i ever bought it's not even really an eyeshadow palette it's an eyeshadow palette but this is the one i first one i ever bought it was the urban decay naked reloaded palette it was hot <laughs> It was like sixty five dollars in my pocket, and at that time, I couldn't do it. Jay broke. <laughs> but I specifically decided to buy this shallot. The shallot. It was for prom. It was for my high school prom. It was for my high school prom, and I specifically decided to buy this palette for this specific shade, Angel Dust, I believe it's called. Angel Fire. A beautiful shade. I use it only for highlight. <laughs> I, as you can see, I didn't never really touch these other colors. I'm, I'm gonna try to change that. But I got my own. I, I got my own palette now, so. Oh, but yeah, so I decided I just wanted to really try everything once, and I was like, a cosmetic business that don't sound bad. Like it, it's it's very pricey to get started, but as I said, I just came up with the idea in like the tenth grade, and I've just been working on it ever since. And I really started it when I hit college. Yeah, so all them years, I knew I wanted a business. I knew it. I never told anybody. This is something I kept to myself for a very long time. I would just... I never told anybody. I just... I told my mama. I told my mama, but I myself didn't even think I was really going to go along with it. But I always knew. 
I was writing notes. This is what I want to do. This is what I want to do. But I was like, she ain't. I ain't never gonna do it. I ain't really ain't gonna do it. But I ended up doing it, me. Look at my back. Like I'm hunchback, trying to get in the camera angle, y'all. In the comments, can you please leave a link to the best tripods? Like I need a new tripod because this is beyond me. So can you in the comments, please? Leave me a comment with the best tripod that y'all have. Plus, I want to take them to the park and get some. I'm over here trying to push in my glasses like I'm wearing glasses. <laughs> I, I have to laugh. I'm sorry. This is so f***ing ridiculous. I want to take my tripod to the park and take some pictures. And it's best if I have that little wireless remote so that I can snap. I'll take pictures if y'all know what I'm saying. Like, so I'm going to keep going to my phone to keep snapping, snapping. In the comments, leave me some, please. I'm moving on from the cosmetic industry into the packaging industry. Unisex packaging for small and big businesses. Click the link right in the link. It's a beacon link right down below. You can click it and it'll take you to all my information so you guys can learn more about me in just a simple click of a link. Look, I'm so makeup techie. Like, I got the pro concealer. Let's get into it. It's running out, but I'm in the shade porcelain. I think I'm a little bit darker. They try to play me. I'm a little bit darker. So on my website, I do sell products as well as services. Some of the products I sell business cards, custom packaging, duct tape. This one is mine. Y'all see this big corner room? This one's mine. It says my business name low and it says you got great taste, babe. I did not leave my cosmetic industry, the cosmetic industry because of sales. Sales was not a factor. I'm trying to make it flat because this is an eyeshadow brush. <laughs> This is an eyeshadow brush, but I'm trying to make it like a flat head so I can use it as my concealer brush. I'm just saying, girl, be making it work. I did not leave because of sales. Sales is not a factor, but I mean, if you can get more money, why not? So the foundation I'm using is the Dewey and Smooth Fit Me Foundation for the normal to dry skin. And I normally mix it with my Pro Concealer, but I mean, it's it's nothing else in there. <laughs> it's nothing else in there right now. Let me tell you this. Pro tip. Stop mentioning small businesses and whatever you're doing. Like, yeah, use it in hashtags because a lot of people use those hashtags. But stop limiting yourself. You don't only work for small businesses, babe. What's up? If you have a business, be sure when you visit my website, click the beacon link, as I said already. Visit my website, and it's going to be a pop-up that pops up. Just put in your email, sign up for my email list. I'm using a precisely my brow pencil. This is what I used to use for my eyebrows, but I ran out. I'm going to use the spoolie part. This is the pencil part. I'm going to use the back, the spoolie end. cosmetic i like the cosmetic industry and all but i was like i feel like this ain't really my purpose you know i loved what i did everybody that supported me but for some reason i just felt like you know i, I feel like this ain't my call name it definitely i'm not gonna sit here and try to buzz it out I, I felt like I needed to start off in the cosmetic industry to get where I am now because it was a great start. It definitely was a booster to get into the packaging business, like financially, mentally. It was a good start. Learn, learning how to communicate with customers, learning how to go about this before I get to where I am now. So it was a, it was a great start. So I'm happy that God gave me that vision that I should start here, but this ain't where I'm gonna always be. I'm gonna evolve, and that's okay. I just wanted to let you guys know that I am changing my business over because for the simple fact that I had somebody come to me and say they wanted to transfer their business. They wanted to go into the credit business, but they was like, how do I jump from fashion just into credit? And it was like, should they? They don't know. Do it. Do it. Like, who's stopping? Who is stopping you? It is your business. You know what I'm saying? And if you can, if you feel like you can even handle it, make two businesses. If you really enjoy fashion and you want to be in a credit business, do both. So I'm glad I'm able to just talk to you guys and let y'all know everything that's really going on. Because I don't want to try to be sitting here confused and not in the loop, you know what I'm saying? 
if you want to follow me on my Instagram, go right ahead. You know what I'm saying? The button's free. The subscribe button's free. The like button's free. And y'all can go follow me. But I ain't want my... I shouldn't have done that. Oi, would you forgive me? So definitely if you have a business, need business cards, thank you cards, anything, even I'll take requests. Like you can email me. Don't DM me any requests. Please email me as best as you email me. I had people tell me they wanted wholesale tissue paper. I had people tell me they wanted wholesale boxes. Yeah, I'm just gonna start with my packaging business, but I'm I got y'all. I definitely got y'all. Give me not even a month. Give me a give me a give me 25 days. I'm working on it. Now let's do our simple everyday makeup looks. Literally. These are my two. These are my four favorite. These are the shades I always use along with the glitter. I'm sensing a nice inner outer corner. Inner outer, inner outer, inner outer, inner outer. Say that ten times fast. Take my finger. One. That's already one swipe. Let's get it. Let's do two. Two. You see how I barely touched it? Oh, I'm so pigmented. Okay, let's do this one. This one. Right under my finger. One. You see how I just. Bro, oh, that's one swipe. Bad pigmented. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. And look, let's do two. Two. Oh, all well done. Look. Oh. Okay, let's swipe it. Where the third one come from? Oh wait, that's my shadow. Bye. This look. That I thought that was a line. That's just my bone. I'm in love. My love. I'm too turned up. Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts. Niggas caught me slipping once, okay, so what? Some I've been looking, trying to keep it peaceful. Is it struggle for me? Don't pull up. All right, guys, I forgot to take a thumbnail picture. I just poked myself in the eye, so this is the best time to do it. Driving solo, I'm just swerving through my hands. When I'm sober, I just don't like who I am. Hold me up a four and I feel like myself again Blow me up some dope and I feel like myself again I'ma break every box they try to put me in I'm okay. You might see a lot of hair come out, but it's it's okay. Believe me. I'm just wetting my hair to activate the color. I turned off my fan because it causes a lot of things in it. And bad enough, I got a lot of that already. So. A lot of water causes frizz too, so I don't want to overwater it, but I just want to activate it. This is not going to be the best curly hair video. Curly hair recent because mind you, my day is on day five of just putting curl curling products in it. This is day five. It's not the best curl, but it's curls. I'm going to take out cancel. I kind of like it better without lashes, if I'm going to be real. I really do. Cancel. Can you? Yes, you can, babe. Mostly focusing on the roots of my hair and the ends, cause those are the main parts that get crazy. Oh, 
in the back. You can do a design in your hair, do your edges. I'm not gonna do it like really. I'm not. I'm not. I'm just gonna hold it. Okay, yeah, that's as much as an edge we're gonna get. But so let's say I'm just gonna plop and put it right in a ponytail when I'm playing. That's all for this video, you guys. I love y'all. I hope y'all understand why I decided to leave the cosmetic industry and go into the packaging industry. And, I mean, if you don't understand, respectfully, it's not meant for you to understand everything. Nobody's supposed to know everything. Respectfully. So, you don't gotta understand. But, if you want some more clarification, more understanding, be sure to comment and I'll answer you to the, to the best of my ability to try to help you to understand. Or, like, if you got questions, email me. <laughs> I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video.